this appears to be a new mailbag. <laughs> Welcome back to the channel, guys. Quick mailbag for you. Got some adapters here. These are from Amazon. I needed to go from my Raspberry Pi to a standard VGA monitor. So uh, these adapters are uh, an active one as well as comes with audio. So it goes from uh, HDMI to VGA, handy dandy. Then I can use my big PC monitors for a Raspberry Pi. Big package here from Banggood. This is actually a uh, sponsored review. So they sent me these products for free. And what we got, <laughs> lots of Banggood stickers. We got some motors, hopefully, and some props for my quadcopters. How do we get into this thing? Very cool. Red tri-blade should be 5040 by 3, I believe. Uh, 5 by 4 by 3, yes. So they should be pretty standard stuff. Really nice. I like these. These are uh, relatively kind of a no-name brand. So it says unbreakable prop. <laughs> I bet you I can break them. As well, we got some Racer Star brushless motors. I think these will be great to retrofit my old 210 because I've got one of my Emacs motors, the bearing is failing in it. So, BR2205 should be 2300 kV, I believe, not marked. So, oh, there may be so. Yep, 2300. Kind of cool, interesting looking motor, very budget price. So, we're going to give them a try. In this package, we've got some motor controllers. These are from eBay. And I saw these on actually on, on an RC Life On video, and I thought, geez, these might be really, really handy. It's just a pot driven uh, voltage control for motors. So, 3 to 15 volt. So, really cool for 12 volt circuits, and it actually has an off position on the on the pot so i i think this would be kind of fun for some projects we'll see next package this is a breakout board for the arduino mega and let's see if we can get into it this should have all the components we need to do screw terminals on a breakout board for the Arduino Mega, which will be very nice for the robot project. I think this will work fantastic. Very budget priced. Again, check out my how to buy things on eBay video if you'd like to purchase these. And if you like these videos, guys, take just one moment and click that thumbs up. It lets me know you're out there and like these videos. It really, really helps me to know that you guys enjoy these and uh, well, that you're out there. Yeah, cheers. What else we got? We got some battery straps. Uh, who knows what brand that is? Came from China. Very cheap, budget priced. Check this stuff out. This is a plasticine, but it's polymer based. And I've never used this before. This is actually, um, it's just a clay except polymer and you heat it up in the oven to cure it. So uh, I, as you guys know, I love 3D printing. This is a, another option for hand making some parts. We're, we'll give this a go in an upcoming video. Craziness, check these out. I have wanted these for a long time. These are uh, terminal strips for wiring. And these are good up to 600 volts, 15 amp, but nice covered terminal strip. So you could use these for like home automation installs and stuff like that. And they, they are like, I, it feels like a really good ABS, which is pretty standard. Uh, I'm not really familiar with all the different materials, but it feels like ABS. And then a standard terminal strip, nothing to it. Just nice screws. Uh, 
pretty straightforward. We can use uh, uh, spade connections in there, or you could terminate directly to wire or soldered or tinned wire. So very cool. I got tons and tons and tons of them. Again, budget priced as always. STM32 programmer for programming very specific microcontrollers. Uh, I needed this to program some uh, receivers, RC receivers. The only way to flash the firmware, the, the tool that they made available, one person made available, it needs the ST link. So there we go. Finally got my hands on one. Some terminal connections. These are Tamiya style terminal connections. This is for the Airsoft the AEG. Uh, I need to tee in some power or tee off some power for an Arduino or Raspberry Pi Zero. So I just grab some connectors. We got here we have looks like. Wemos D1 Minis. You've seen these on the channel now. Uh, I use these for my Amazon Alexa projects. They work awesome. It's an absolutely incredible little microcontroller for the price at under five bucks. It does uh, everything a small Arduino can do, except has Wi-Fi built in. It's just awesome. And it programs with the Arduino IDE, the Arduino programming environment. I love that. These are HC12 wireless uh, transceivers. They will take direct serial and just parrot it right back out but uh, at a significant range the range on these is touted to be about a kilometer so or more actually significantly more in many cases so they come with a standard little coily antenna and I did get some antennas somewhere for this that plug on uh, for an external um, long wire style antenna a full wavelength antenna so we'll give them a try really cool one check this out this is the last year's model of Samsung gear 360 360 degree camera so I'm going to do some 360 vids on the channel again my previous camera actually got damaged the lens uh, has a big chip in it now one lens so I can't do much for 360 videos and it was only 1080 this is full 4k 360 degree view so I'm gonna use this to show you my my new uh, studio space very soon so stick around the channel you'll uh, get to see this I'm, I'm gonna play with this tonight I just itching to get this out of the box if you don't mind, click that thumbs up on this video, as I mentioned before. It really helps the channel, guys. I will see you soon. I hope you enjoyed this mailbag, and let's build some cool stuff out of these components. Good luck in all your projects.